Three people are in serious condition following a collision involving a police car on the M1 at Helen's Vale. The incident, which occurred earlier today, has led to lane closures and traffic delays on the busy motorway. According to reports from the scene, the police car was rear-ended by another vehicle, causing a significant impact. Emergency services responded swiftly to the scene, with paramedics treating multiple patients for various injuries. Among those injured are two children, whose condition remains serious. The third person involved in the crash is also reported to be in a critical state. The exact circumstances leading to the collision are yet to be determined, and investigations are ongoing. The crash has resulted in the closure of several lanes on the M1, leading to heavy congestion and delays for motorists traveling through the area. Traffic authorities are advising drivers to seek alternative routes where possible and to exercise caution when navigating through the affected area. Witnesses to the incident have described scenes of chaos and confusion following the collision. Many expressed shock at the severity of the crash and expressed their concerns for the welfare of those involved. This latest incident serves as a stark reminder of the dangers faced by emergency service workers and the importance of road safety for all motorists. It also highlights the need for vigilance and attention when driving, particularly in high traffic areas such as the M1. As investigations into the crash continue, authorities are urging anyone with information or dashcam footage of the incident to come forward and assist with inquiries. The priority now is on providing support and medical treatment to those injured in the collision. So, the collision on the M1 at Helen's Vale has left three people seriously injured and caused significant disruption to traffic in the area. Our thoughts are with the victims and their families as they undergo treatment and recovery. We urge all motorists to drive safely and responsibly on our roads.